Yeah, we still have we have possession of the property. Mm -hmm. uh, we're paying us and everything as a deposit, but what happened is this is a little bit of a little thing. Um, I got a security stick here, and she did too, but we were kind of hiding our stick.
major, uh, we have a major uh, uh, sewage thing. Can you come by, please? Well, there's just rocks in your kitchen. Yeah, just come, come right by the house. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. All right. Uh, so what's the name of the landlord or the manager? Uh, Sammy Mosmith. Mosmith? Yeah, something like that. Mosmith. Uh, and then there's a three that we know of. There's like... Okay, how do I get a hold of Sam? Do you have a number for him? Yeah. See, these guys have all been contacted a hundred times every time. They, they, they promised us the, the stuff, and so here's our stuff. Are you just going on, going on, going on, and doing nothing? Uh, no, we're not around. Okay, uh, This is the, the management company, Sammy Moswith. It's uh, an S&M, S&M property management. Hi, how you doing? It's uh, 626-840-8824. Yeah, okay. and, then, and then there's a... Uh, Who's the guy that you said that owns the property? Well, they all push it back to each other. And they come and say, they're the owner. Oh, no, they're not the owner. And they talk to him, and then I'm the owner. And it's, it's just a dilemma. Okay, hey, what, this is Mohammed. Mohammed? I don't know his last name, uh, but we, we looked up the property. Yeah, uh, 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 huh? 919. 8187. Okay. And then uh, the other guy is uh, Hussein. Hussein. And uh, uh, his number is. Uh, let's see. Uh, his number is Hussein. It's 818. 919. 6. Okay. Um, Alright, so let me talk to Ophelia really quick out here in front. Now, I'll be right back. Okay. Public works. Um, here's what happened. There's the, uh, this, this line right here. Because this line right here, um, I, uh, this was a flood, okay? A couple floods happened, nothing. I had the, the, the owners made me take this off. Anyway, so the next flood that I took the floor up, this is what I found under there. This is all sewer water coming up, okay? This under here is hollow, okay? And we pumped about 500 gallons of black sewage out. Um, and then we went along and uh, right here, these right here, these were all the rocks in here, from over here, under here. And so I took the rocks out and sand, this is always like that. and. Uh, so I wonder what the hell is that? We always smell a little something. We don't have a very good sense of smell at all. So, but we found the power line, right? The power line was in sewage. Lost sewage water. If I open this up, you'll smell it. So, I take all the rocks out. I'm calling these guys. Uh, they promise a plumber, no plumber. We brought plumbers in, and we got all these estimates for Seth, and the plumbers didn't want to do it. And they said $3,500 to find the, the sewer. And they, yeah. I found the sewer. Uh -huh. Okay, now that part of the, the sewer, sewer, see the sewer that goes down? That's the lateral. Yes, and there's the one that goes straight down there, and the one that goes there. That's a piece of it. That's been cut. This part was cut and filled with cement. This part is open. Okay, I have the, and I got video tape, and I haven't covered it. But it's, it's, it's open, and uh, we confirmed that from the, uh, the guys, the plumbers, that the, the toilet has is draining that they can hear. Okay, now, here's the thing. I'm going all the way down here, and... Uh, all the way down here, you see this layer right there? That's, mud, that's like, uh, it's got car parts, it's got all kinds of mud in there. And it's, it's compacted over here, right? And then we've got sewage. Every square inch of this place has sewage. Thick sewage, thick. I mean, a lot. Not just leaking from here, but actually placed here. Okay? And it comes all the way down through here. Gas comes up. Gas. Gas company came up in the yard out here, and we said, oh my god, you guys are going to get the hell out of here. Period. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. You guys have to go, okay? And uh, so he says, he said it, it's like, so how do you put sulfide or uh, methane and other things, right? So he said, keep the, the water, keep the lawn, keep everything wet, because that'll stop the pull it down, and then the gas is coming in. We did, everyone that came out here, every professional, everything ran out of here, so that can't be fixed, the, uh, the house, because it's like, that's where the sewer going up to, right? And then they, people, everyone gets dizzy back here. And then people come back here to, to work, to and they got, you know, they got, they 
got here. Um, see all that black stuff? And this is where it just it pops up. You'll see all the bubbles. Back to here. This right here, there's a wall underneath this ground now. And it comes up. The, there's a wall of that stuff right there, these bricks and everything. Way deep. Uh, a couple feet deep and, and it's just all the way through here. This just happened when I was washing the place. And this thing, the whole thing buckled. Yeah, so the house is dropping, okay? So this is a really super deep hole. Noxious stuff comes out of there, and that's why I put those in there in a minute, right? And so I'm spraying the whole thing down with uh, lime water, hydrogen peroxide, and ammonia, like they said, you know, on the EP. Okay, now, let me set this up. Now, these guys live next door, and they got children and everything. And see, this is sewage. I mean, this is just raw fucking sewage, okay? All this stuff. The white stuff. Now, this is stuff I took out of the house, and it was smelling so bad, and I put it out here. And the guys, uh, uh, they told me, you know, spray it all down with uh, uh, chlorine and then follow it up with the, uh, uh, the lime water to kill it. You know, let the sun dry it out and kill it and you can throw it away, right? So it won't make everybody poisoned, sick. Because everyone, we get sick. We're just being here right now is going, my guts are going. And uh, we have, uh, uh, we got tests coming back and we're getting ourselves tests. But we are, we're really sick and I treated ourselves for hydrogen sulfide poisoning and stuff. And it went right away, man. Six months of fucking being sore and shit like that went right up the other way. Oh, so seven months, eight months, six, seven months. Now hey, down man. here, this is a sewage field. From here, from there, over there. All this stuff is sewage. And it's starting to dry up, so it's like scaring me because of the, the gas. And that's like a water table. This is always wet and water comes up through it. Now and then, it just does. It rises up and gets wet. What we deal with is the main sewer line. Okay. The main sewer line is the problem. But believe me, if I had a problem with the main sewer line, everybody on the whole block would be standing. Well, yeah. Well, you know what everybody would have been if I didn't stop this because of uh, uh, just black water, sewer water. I'm going to go double check the map. So what about this? Come here. Can you, can you look at this? There's sinkholes. There's all these holes that form. And anywhere you go, man, it is sewer. This this is built up on the edges, all the way around it, all the way around, and it's just pure sewer. Yeah. I got it. Huh? That's a good new dude. Are you getting dizzy? No shit? Yeah, everyone gets dizzy back here. And then, so, you know, we come to do our work. All this stuff, there's about $4,000 of uh, my gear, all kinds of clones, all that stuff in there. Look the avocados. We, we had, the avocados were never big, and uh, ever in 35 years, and, and I got them to grow. I was real for the growth master. I had to get a day to fertilize. Yeah, well, I think it's, you know, if we have something in the soil, like, he said there's VOCs in here, that's how we do it. That's when VOCs come out. Yeah, it's a cool stuff in there. This stuff comes up all the fire department. Let me look at that one. So we'll see about Monday. <laughs> well, hold on one second. Did you check? Yeah, he's, he's You're getting right now? Okay. So he's getting uh, dirty. Uh, okay. 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 Did you guys just see me can you cross the drain line? Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, no, the drain line. The drain. We brought in plumbers. Uh, the plumbers said that the drain line is not hooked up. Oh. The drain line right, so what happened with the police department this morning? Well, the police department, they they, they called us, woke me up out of bed, and they said, oh, they were here with the, uh, uh, they were here with an insurance uh, inspector, and they were here with an insurance inspector, and they were here with all of our neighbors, yeah, her shop, yeah, talk to all of our neighbors, okay, they said that they haven't been able to get a hold of us. Okay. Uh, I got people in the ocean, 
I don't know. Yeah, probably so. I don't think it. You're but, but here's what I, money comes out this way and goes forward. Okay, here's what I, okay, come on, yeah. let me show you. So we got, um, we got the sewage. Thank you. 